let's talk about the nickel prism nickel prism is designed by the great physicist and scientist mr william nickel one of the most common forms of the nickel prism is made by taking a calcite crystal whose length is a three times its breadth it is cut into two halves along the diagonal so that their face angles are 72 degree and 180 degree and the two halves are joined together by a layer of canada balsam a transparent cement which is shown here we are able to see the rays are passed the ordinary ray is reflected and the extraordinary is coming out So for sodium light, the refractive index of our ordinary light is 1.65 each and for extraordinary light is 1.486. The refractive index for Canada balsam is, this is the one, 1 1.550 for both rays. Hence Canada balsam does not polarize light. A monochromatic beam of unpolarized light is incident on the face of the nickel prism it splits into two rays one is the ordinary ray the other one is extraordinary ray inside the nickel prism therefore the double refraction is taking place the ordinary ray is totally internally reflected at the layer of canada balsam and is prevented from emerging from the other face the extraordinary ray alone is transmitted through the crystal which is plane polarized. The nickel prism serves as a polarizer and also as an analyzer.